Rao is brewing tonight over a government plan to invite the Chinese to build a new nuclear reactor on the coast of Essex. The Essex MP, Bernard Jenkin, said there were serious security issues. His comments come after reports that Britain and China could sign a nuclear deal next week, paving the way for new reactors at both Sizewell and Bradwell. Could this one day be home to the first Chinese-designed and operated nuclear reactor on British soil? That's the sweetener being offered to the Chinese by George Osborne. In return, they would invest in new nuclear reactors at both Hinkley Point and Sizewell in Suffolk. But some see the Bradwell plan as a potential threat. Bernard Jenkins' constituency borders the site. He says the government has failed to assess the implications for national security. And I've also discovered GCHQ, the security services, MOD, are deeply concerned about this. If we buy kit with Chinese programmed chips in the control systems, we don't know what software they put in them. We won't even be allowed to look to see what software they put in them. The fear is software could be used against Britain should diplomatic relations with China sour in the future. Last month, the Chancellor was in Beijing. Next week, the Chinese president visits Britain, when it's expected the nuclear deal could be confirmed. A deal one advisor to the UK government says other countries wouldn't touch. The Americans uh, wouldn't even consider uh, letting the Chinese into nuclear energy infrastructure. There, there would be no case for it. There would be no way that that could possibly happen. Nuclear is different from other energy systems. It has different risks. It has different uh, concerns. For years, businesses have worked to foster closer links with China. The Chinese have already invested millions in the eastern region. Investments, some believe, mustn't be put at risk. The security implications are really important and it's vital for government to look at that. Uh, but we shouldn't underestimate the economic potential and the jobs that will be created from overseas investment. Bernard Jenkin fears a Chinese deal at Bradwell is being presented as a fait accompli. He says if there's no assessment of the security implications, there should be an inquiry in Parliament. Richard Daniel, BBC Look East. The Norfolk Coastline.